Hello guys, this is Ruben Raj and welcome back to Laravel Tutorials. In my previous videos, I have shown how to use migrations in Laravel and how to create tables using migrations and uh, how to modify the parameters, fields in the table using migrations. And in this video, I am going to show how to give relationship between uh, tables like uh, primary key, foreign key kind of stuff. For that, what I am going to do is I am going to show a simple example where I can uh, show uh, how to give primary key and foreign key relationship between tables for that I'm going to use the table which I have created in the previous video called customers and uh, In this video, I'm going to create a, one more table called uh, orders and I'm going to give relationship between both of them and the relationship will be uh, You can consider one to many relationship and uh, uh, one to one relationship for example, a customer can have mul multiple orders and uh, the relationship is uh, one to many because one customer and many orders. So this is a one to many relationship and uh, you can look the same relationship from the reverse order like each order belongs to a customer. So this is one to one relationship. And uh, first I'll create the migration file to create orders table. For that, I'm going to use the command called php artisan make a migration file. And the migration file name is going to be uh, create a order stable. And uh, we can provide the flag create. And the table name is going to be orders. And here, what we are telling is this is uh, the create orders table is going to be the file name, migration file name. And uh, what we are trying to do is we are trying to create a table and the table name is orders. And uh, it says the migration file is created. I'm going to open the migration file. You can see here the migration file is created here. So I'll open it quickly and I'll add the parameters which belongs to orders table. And uh, the first one is uh, going to be a string. And uh, the column name will be uh we can say items because if you order something there will be some items a uh, customer orders some items so it's a kind of and uh, the second uh, column will be an integer it could be quantity because if you order some item you will specify how many quantity you want and here I'm going to create a field uh, what yes field called uh, customer ID because each order should belongs to a customer sh should belong to a customer so I should give a name called uh, customer ID and I should uh, what I have to do is I should uh, specify this as unsigned you should do this otherwise uh, the laravel migrations i mean when you try to migrate this file you will uh, get an error so don't forget to uh, give this function and uh, here what i'm going to do is i'm going to uh, give the relationship what i'm going to say is i'm going to describe the schema that uh, this customer id is going to be the foreign key in this table order and uh, I need to give the reference where ha actu actually where uh, the primary key uh, resides on. For example, here I'm going to say that foreign and uh, this customer ID and I have to give the reference using the reference function references and uh, here i have to specify the column name in the in the parent table here the parent table is customer and i uh, have to provide the on function uh, and i have to pass the parameter customer customers because the table name is customers so here you can see what i'm saying is uh, i'm defining the schema that this customer id in the orders table uh, referring the ID from the customers table actually I am giving the relationship between the orders 
table and the customers table using these two IDs. So this is what uh, I wanted to create here. And uh, actually I'm going to uh, have one more thing here called uh, soft deletes. I will explain what is soft deletes in my upcoming videos. I think it's a uh, soft delete. I'll close this. Uh, and uh, I think everything is uh, uh, set to migrate. So for I'm going to migrate this file. So you can see here there is a uh, no table called orders. So now I'm going to migrate PHP artisan migrate. And it says uh, the file is migrated. So now you can go and refresh your database and you will see the new table called orders and uh, you can go and check out the structure and the structure says uh, I have ID I have items and uh, the quantity is integer and the customer ID is int and what we have done is we have give the reference of this customer ID to the ID in the customers so so far there is no uh, data available in the table so I'm just uh, showing how these uh, relationship mechanism works and how to create this relationship with the migration migration file and here i have used soft deletes uh, so this will create one more column called uh, deleted at so we can uh, keep track on uh, the data when the data is deleted and the other stuff and uh, this is all for this video guys and uh, and you can uh, try the same thing in your machine and uh, if you have any doubt you can uh, write it in my i write it in the comment box and if you like this video, please give a thumbs up and you can do subscribe to my channel. And uh, yes, guys, thanks. Thanks for watching this video. Bye bye.